good morning good afternoon or good evening whatever may be the time you are seeing this uh, film uh, today we are going to talk about micro photography what are the various ways available currently if you see the pictures there are three pictures in this screen the picture in the center uh, will give you a single star because even though it shows the cells and the stroma differently but the cellular details are not seen very well whereas the picture on the right i will give you two stars because the morphology is better seen when compared to the picture one the stroma is very nicely seen but the cellular details are not that completely seen whereas in the picture in the leftmost i will give you a star of three because the morphology is very well seen you can see even the prominent nucleoli which are small in size and the stroma is very well differentiated with the epithelium so we can take various types of uh, images but we have to get the best quality and why we have to get the best quality micro photography number one it is for teaching the postgraduate and undergraduate students number two in clinical presentations where we can impress the non pathology clinicians by showing nice pictures and number three for good publication we need pictures of excellent quality and the by product of this picture can be used in some patients for diagnosis also if you don't know what is happening in a slide or in a patient's sample you can take pictures and send it for second opinion for diagnosis so let us see in this short film what are all the methods of uh, micro photography available i hope you will enjoy What's happening, Ritika? Sorry. Sir, we want to take a picture of the slides. So, so we have a clinical pattern. So we have a pattern. Okay. So you want the microscope? Yes. Why is this an urgent one? Yes, sir. I don't mind giving the microscope, but uh, do you know what are the other ways you can take the picture? Yes, sir. We can focus the slide in the microscope and take a photo of the field in our phone, sir. Do you have this slide? Yes. You show me how you do that. Take some time and it uh, goes out of focus and uh, again on the focus, isn't it? Yes. Any other method, uh, Swati, you know? Sir, so we can take, uh, we can take a picture of the monitor which is attached to the microscope. This monitor? Yes, sir. Okay. Any other way? So we can, uh, we can take it through the computer and we can save it in the flash drive. Super. Sir, so there's one more way. Sir. We can scan the entire slide in the water and uh, take a photo, sir. Oh, that's one more way. So now, I want to show you one another out of the box thinking. That is known as silica. Both of you, have you seen this? No, sir. This is what I am talking about. Silica. You keep your microscope next to that you will see the difference. Instead of the eyepiece, yes. they use the small holder. And we have to put a adapter. And we can use this. This is the silica microscope as Sir has already told. So the silica microscope has got a small microscope compared to our uh, routine things. And we can connect our iPad or cell phone through an adapter to this microscope. So this, as the size is small, is easily portable and it is actually less expensive compared to our routine microscopes. Okay. So the uh, slide we can keep it over here, we can focus at any power we want and we can see it through the camera. 
so it can be either this round or we can take it to a full frame so the main advantages are we can take a snap of it we can send the photographs to an expert for an opinion if we want or we can take a video of it and this video can be a dynamic telepathology where the expert can see the video of this slide and as it runs through the various areas can be focused as well cmv infection in the endometria beautiful intranuclear and intracytoplasmic inclusions and advantage is this uh, silica microscope can be connected to the projector and this projector can be used for slide discussions for postgraduate teaching as well as for undergraduate teaching the slides of the undergraduates are focused and the classes has been put in the e moodle hi friends i hope you enjoyed the microphotography and the methods described in that to see the quality of the picture time taken to take the picture and what is the cost involved in talking about microphotography the simple and easiest method is mobile to microscope where you can use your mobile phone to take the picture through the eyepiece of any microscope but it is a technical art please believe me it won't come to everybody you have to focus it very nicely it takes a long time but the quality will be good and cost is very low because you don't use anything extra it is simple mobile phone and the microscope the second method is camera attached to the microscope which is attached to the monitor here you take the picture through the camera and focus it on the monitor the quality will be very bad because it shows lot of lines and uh, surroundings you cannot edit it very nicely but the advantage is you can take the shots very quickly cost is also higher side because you need a camera attached with the microscope and you need a monitor attached to the camera the third method is camera attached microscope and the camera is attached to the computer also so the pictures can be stored in the computer and they can be transferred through the flash drive the quality will be very good but again it takes a long time because you have to take the picture you have to put the slide take the picture save it in the computer and then from the computer you do the editing and then transfer it to a flash drive cost is also high because you need a microscope you need a camera you need a computer and the fourth method is whole slide scanner where the slide is scanned completely by a machine and pictures are available in the monitor please believe me this gives the best quality picture in the world but the time taken is very long because the slide has to be scanned and then the picture has to be taken and the cost is very high because currently the whole slide scanner is a very costly affair but the good news is the price is coming down but even though from crores it has come to lakhs in india and this will be the future of pathology to combine all these positive and negative things we have another one which we saw in the short movie that is known as silica the quality will be very good and the time is again shortest because we don't have a ips instead of ips we use the mobile phones or tab or ipads and you take the picture immediately and the cost is also very low because uh, this microscope will be cheaper than a camera attached microscope with a computer so this will be the current hero in taking the pictures provided if you don't have the whole slide scanner as i told you before if you have the whole slide scanner that gives the best quality picture so coming to the parts of the silica here you can see the light source and this is the stage for this slide and these are the objectives and this is the body of the 
silica microscope and this is the adapter and this adapter uh, is for a iPhone 6 plus uh, in this body we have the battery locator which can be recharged just want to show you briefly the parts of the silica on the back because it has few interesting features number one is the charging port you can charge the uh, rechargeable battery number two is the on off switch please uh, don't forget to put it on before using it and number three is the LED indicator that uh, shows you the functionality of the microscope and the last but uh, most important thing is it has its own USB port for example if you are using a mobile or iPad that is running short of uh, uh, battery level you can immediately charge it through from the uh, silica microscope itself through this USB port. It's a very very innovational thing. And as I told before, we can use any adapters to use. Any phones can be uh, given its own adapter and you can use it along with the silica microscope. The advantages of silica are it is highly portable you might have seen in that uh, film uh, it is it comes in a small bag you can carry it as a shoulder bag as i told it is having a rechargeable battery and because of the rechargeable battery we don't need electricity at the point of use any devices mobile tab ipads can be used as a display and the major advantage is instant photos and videos can be taken and you know the advantage of having a photo in a mobile you can share it to your friends and social media in no time for educational purposes video calls can be made if you have a sim card and if it is an iphone you can make a facetime call otherwise uh, in a wireless environment you can make a whatsapp call and you can use the display as a viewing screen for the receiver and they can give second opinions on seeing the pictures and you can move the slide on the stage and you can use it as a dynamic telepathology and as you have seen in that uh, short film this display can be connected to a projector and it can be used in slide seminars and in discussions and lastly but not leastly silica has its own app in android and ios and this app helps you in morphometry and annotation of the pictures because it's a highly portable with a rechargeable battery the main important uh, thing we have to remember is use of uh, this silica in remote areas for example if you want to screen for malaria in a remote uh, village where there is no electricity you can use this camera i hope you all know this terminology rose rapid on-site evaluation where we pathologists go and see the adequacy of sample in minimally invasive procedures like uh, endoscopic ultrasound guided uh, bronchoscopy they get, take the material and give the material to us we rapidly stain it and see it instead of conventional microscope we can use silica microscope so that you can take pictures and in doubts we can send it immediately to our superiors and uh, get the results immediately so these are all the main uses of silica so this beautiful piece of art he is a brainchild of four young people Samrat, Mahesh, Vinil and Krishma. They can be approached or if you want to know more about Silica you can visit this website metprimetech.com or you can give a call at 9819344264. They are also upgrading the models and they are working on the whole slide image i hope they will come up with a whole slide image that runs in the cost in thousands rather than lakhs so that many indian people can buy and use it i wish all the best to the young team to come up with good products to help the pathologists the students and ultimately 
the patients.